Timbers 360 is presented by Toyota. You mentioned uh, Chara being the new man, signed just 10 days ago, the first designated player in Portland Timbers history. What do you remember of the first day with Chara as a Timber? They're hoping Diego Chara, their new signing, can ignite this team so a lot on his shoulders to get the tempo going. There were pretty high expectations and with the young team that we had, I remember being excited. When he got on the field, you could tell that he kind of came to life. Diego Chara making his MLS debut. He's on the second half of the Portland Timbers. He's a very simple guy, very simple guy. A guy that works really hard for a collective. There's a reason that he's been here uh, for so long and as consistent as he is. He does things the right way. Historic night again for Diego Chara. 376th game with the Portland Timbers. That ties an MLS record for the most games played with one club. You came here for first year MLS for the Timbers. When you came here all those years ago, did you ever think Portland becomes such a part of your life? I saw a good opportunity, a great opportunity for my career. And then now I'm happy, I feel like at home. Cleanly dispossessed by Chara. He's onto the field. And this is a player who's an absolute destroyer in midfield. The word I would use to describe Diego is foundation. Iron Man. Tenacious. He's clever. The best midfielder in Timbers history. Especially on the defensive side, he just hunts, you know, it, it, it's a perfect way to put it. He's a special player and a special talent that we're lucky to get. Now on the attack, trying to defend. Charles, Charles scores! Now Valeri to Chara. All alone. Diego Chara. Tough for me. Chara making a big run. What a scene in a place that has been ground zero for so many big moments. It's an MLS original against a new breed. And so it begins. Now Kamara goes down. Chara looking at the picture of innocence. Chara was just lying in wait, wasn't it? In the last one was in a very different era. Steve Clark has had an absolute shocker. And Diego Valeri is handed a gift. Going to Nappy's aware. It comes across. Wallace is there. It is two for the Timbers. Someone on the Columbus crew better tell them the game started at 4.25 Eastern time. That is it. A first for the Pacific Northwest. The Portland Timbers win MLS Cup 2015. I want to say thank you so much. Your support is very special for us. And enjoy it because this cup is yours. Most people know you for your efforts on the field, your tireless work rate, but you're just as active off the field when it comes to giving back to your community here in Portland and also back in Colombia. Why is giving back so important to you? Bueno, gracias. To be a Caleño, let's call the people from Cali. Uh, it's amazing uh, to grow out in this neighborhood, you know, know the people. It's amazing for me. Come inside. When I live with my family, this place was the living room and uh, plays football, soccer here with my brothers, with my father. I mean, this is a, a lot of memories, good memories here, and they am happy to be back here. Sí, sí. Entonces, dígale, dígale, dígale entonces. Faltan ellos cuatro. <laughs> Ah, Cherry, ¿no? O sea, fue producto de todo lo que eh, vivieron en la casa, porque en la casa también había mucha disciplina, mucha perseverancia, y tenían que salir adelante en lo que a ellos les gustaba, que a pesar de donde ellos nacieron y se criaron, fueran unas excelentes personas para que todo el mundo los tuviera como referente. A ver, eh, gracias primero por darme la oportunidad de estar aquí. Eh, espero hoy que podamos disfrutar un poco, eh, pasarla bien. Eh, lógicamente, la competencia siempre va a ser eh, de antemano. Gracias por darme la oportunidad de estar aquí. Y bueno, esperamos de que lo disfrutemos. 
He's a model for young young guys, and inside the field is a high level. Uh, elite uh, player. Every season becomes more important for the group. Everyone know Diego Char on the field as the guy that's getting into crazy tackles and getting yellow cards, um, but they also know Diego Char and his smile, right? And I think that uh, translates into him and his family and how important um, his wife, his family, his kids are to him. Um, and just as great of a player as he is on the field, he's an even better person off the field. Welcome to Timbers 360, I'm your host, Jake Sivan. On a rainy week in Portland, we're inside the boot room here at the Portland Timbers training facility on a special week for a club legend. With his start against LAFC on Saturday, Diego Chara set the MLS record for most games played by a player for a single club in league history. Also the record for the most starts for a single club in league history. Congratulations to the godfather, to the legend, Diego Chara. Coming up, we go behind the scenes for Diego Chara's 377th appearance as a Portland Timber. We'll hear from his former teammates, competitors, and friends. We'll get ready for tomorrow's match against Charlotte FC, and we'll relive the top moments in Diego Chara's illustrious Timbers career. Welcome back. Uh, it was a big day and weekend for Timbers legend, Diego Chara. Our cameras were with him the whole time. Come with us as we go behind the scenes on his record setting evening in total access. I feel really happy to be here, you know. And uh, again, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I'm really proud of you guys. I'm proud of me too. And uh, thank you so much. It's match day. The team gets ready to travel to BMO Stadium for their game against LAFC. had a special surprise for Diego. Everybody wearing number 21 for warm-ups and the trademark Chara move, shirts tucked in. Everyone wanted to get a chance to congratulate the man of the hour. Come on, 
catch the rest of this video, visit Timbers.com. Timbers 360 is presented by Toyota. The man that just doesn't seem to age, a smile that does not change. Throughout his career, Diego Chara has played with and against some wonderful players. They have a special message for Diego. Diego, I wanted to congratulate you about this record. It's amazing. Uh, enjoy. And obviously, uh, it talks a lot about how you are and you know how, how you enjoy this profession, or how professional you are. And I had the chance to, to share many of those games with you. And uh, it was a pleasure. Diego. Enjoy this moment, enjoy this game, uh, live it as you always do, and obviously enjoy it with your family. Congrats, Diego. Uh, what more can I say about you? Uh, one of my idols, one of the best to ever do it in this league. Thank you for being there for me, someone that I look up to, not just in the past, but still to, until this day, and uh, irreplaceable. And uh, thank you for being part of my journey, and I'm sure Portland is uh, incredibly happy that you've been able to be a part of their journey. And then congrats again more than deserving. Hey Diego, congrats man. It's uh, been phenomenal watching you play, you're a true Iron Man. Uh, cheers to your record and to uh, 300 more. Que Oniche, por aquí felicitándolo por por el nuevo récord, creo que es una persona merecedora de, de todo lo que consigue en la vida, creo que sus éxitos es, llegan a base del trabajo y la dedicación que usted le pone a todo, entonces creo que que es un momento muy lindo para usted, para su familia y, y espero lo disfrute al máximo. Diego, congratulations. 377 games of perfection. I've seen every single one of them, so I can say that. It's been a great honor for me to follow your career, but most importantly, getting to know the person you are. Couldn't happen to a better person. Congrats. Diego, how are you? Uh, Nick Romando here. It's been a while. I uh, just want to reach out and congratulate you on having the most appearances with one single MLS club. That is a huge accomplishment. Uh, I remember our battles all the time. Uh, news, when, when I saw your, your name on that lineup, it was going to be a long day. Uh, although you only scored on me one time in those 22 meetings, um, you're a fierce competitor, uh, the fabric of what Portland Timbers are. Uh, and it was a pleasure to play against you. Congratulations on your accomplishment, and I wish you luck the rest of the season. Congrats, Diego. Uh, well deserved. Uh, you are a staple in this league and uh, such a legend for the Timbers. Uh, proud of you, and uh, congratulations. Coming up next on Timbers 360, presented by Toyota, we get ready for this weekend with the matchup. The Timbers' long road trip finally comes to an end this weekend, just one more away from Providence Park as they'll travel to face Charlotte FC on Saturday. It will be the first ever meeting between the two clubs. Charlotte was an expansion team in 2022. This is just their third season in the league. They play at Bank of America Stadium, which is also home to the NFL's Carolina Panthers. And they're really good in that building. They have a 13 game home unbeaten streak that was just snapped a couple weeks ago when they lost 3-0 to Minnesota United. They made a coaching change in the offseason, hiring Englishman Dean Smith. There's a lot of Timbers connections in that organization. On Dean Smith's staff are former Timber assistant and interim head coach Miles Joseph and former Timber center back Pamoto Ka. On the roster, former Timber center back Bill Tuiloma and former Timbers goalkeeper David Bingham. Charlotte FC are off to a difficult start this season. They have just 11 points in 10 games. They're in 11th place in the Eastern Conference and they've scored just 10 goals in those 10 games. Only three teams in the league have scored fewer and it's exactly half of the Timbers goal output of 20 so far this season. Maybe it's just what the Timbers need as they still look for the first clean sheet of the season. It's the Timbers at Charlotte FC. It's a 4.30 Pacific time start on Saturday night. You can watch the match as always on MLS Season Pass on Apple TV. 
Timbers 360 is presented by Toyota. Thanks for tuning in to this week's edition of Timbers 360. We'll end with the best of Diego Chara. See you next week. Diego Chara making his MLS debut. The first designated player in Portland Timbers history. Chara first there to the ball with Pineda. Diego Chara shot, it's a goal! Space here with the runners in front of him. Chara takes it himself, sensational goal! Chara off his shoulder into the path of Diego Valeri and the square for Diego Chara. That was almost in slow motion from one end of the field to the other. On the attack, trying to prevent Chara is there. Chara scores! Portland are furious because they think that Seattle have got away with a few challenges without a booking. Wallace clipping it across. Chara is in. Diego Chara with his head. Blanco, early ball. Diego Chara dribbles the keeper. Bora cutting it back. It's in. Diego Chara will take it. It comes right back across. Chara walks in. is back and so are the Portland Timbers. Cascadia reigns. Portland Timbers win MLS Cup 2015. Portland Timbers have won the Western Conference Championship and they will host MLS Cup. And it's over. The Portland Timbers win the Cascadia Cup.